Uh, hi guys, welcome back to Upshara. So, uh, making it a slug or title instead of ID was pretty easy. Uh, now, in this one, we'll uh, also get the author of this um, post, maybe with the date as well. So, that should be available somewhere here. So, here its uh, author is already available uh, in embedded and date is uh, pretty much there. So, let's, let's put that somewhere in uh, our post here. So, let's start with the date. We'll have P and then we'll have small maybe. And here we have post.date. Uh, it might just give us a string. Instead, we'll convert that into a date. Let's close this. Let's hope this gives us... Yeah, it gave us a date. Uh, let it be. I mean, we don't, we don't mind this. Um, so we got the date. We'll get the author here. Um, the way we can do that is, I think, p post dot author. No, actually, post dot embedded. Or we can actually send author right down here instead of that. Let's go to slug here. So similarly, post dot author equals post dot embedded we'll do our dirty work here dot author and then what we had in the author where is it yeah here um author is also an array um we'll get the first one and then uh, dot name all right and now in here in uh, slug we need we just need post dot author and we got it uh, we can have something like by who wrote this maybe we can make it Mm, bold by using B. I'm using less and less uh, CSS here. I'm just using the tags that is possible. Okay, so let's see if uh, everything is same. Because I have only one author, which is me. Um, so yeah, that works. So this is it, guys. So this is how you get the author and the date. So I'm, I'm thinking of ending this here, but uh, if you have any suggestions to do something more on it, uh, you can let me know. Thanks guys. Bye-bye.